This will be a rep. We'll have a second rep. And then we'll finish with an authentic and loaded dice. What do we have in here? Oof. Ooh, this is clean. This is great. You ready for this, Steven? Let's go. One of, if not the best, flash helmet in the game. We got the Miami Dolphins. Tyree Kill, number two in the NFL in receiving yards. Seven seasons, seven Pro Bowls. Beautiful full-size rep helmet. Not bad. Super Bowl champion, the Cheetah. An absolute great receiver. He was great with the Chiefs. One of my favorite things about Mahomes and Tyree Kill, this is how I know that they're both great. Mahomes was great without Hill, and Hill was great without Mahomes. Uh, that's what, what happens when you're a top three, four guy in the world at what you do. You excel no matter what. Congrats, Kevin, on the Tyree Kill Flash replica. That is not even a headliner in this series. It is ridiculous. The Cheetah. Hey, Mr. Steve Arroyo, that break still needs to close out. So when it closes out, we will do it. Uh, Steve has come over from TikTok. He's very interested in the Josh Jacobs. I do want to be fully transparent with you. I was trying to communicate with him in TikTok saying yeah. that Josh Jacobs is a hidden headliner in our Loaded Dice series. Yes. He has unfortunately been pulled in the wild card, though. Okay. Yep, that's correct, Steven. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Denny doesn't like Dak Prescott. Vinny thinks he's overrated, and I actually agree with Vinny this time. I know you do as well, Steven. It doesn't mean Dak is bad, but he's not consistent. Uh, although, to be honest, of late, I feel like Dak hasn't gotten a lot of love. I would say he might be overrated right now. I think a lot of people are not rating him that high. They're saying that he's the reason the Cowboys might lose, which might be true. So I think he was overrated. I'm not sure I'm not sure he's overrated right now. Uh, here's the Cheetah. This is maybe the second best hit, if not the best hit so far. Uh, cheetah, full-size rep uh, for sure. Uh, can't throw a spiral, says Denny. Uh, 10 to 15 QB quality, says Vinny. I agree with that. Uh, and I think that's where most people have them now. Uh, most of the people having them in the top 10, probably Cowboy fans. So I don't know. He's a little overrated, but I think, you know, the whole country as a whole right now, I don't think people are putting Dak as a top 10 quarterback. Could be wrong, Steve. I hope not. I could be wrong on that. A mechanic stinks, says Denny. Uh, you know what, Steven? This loaded dice series is fantastic. Uh, we had a Tyree Kill flash in the first box as a rep helmet. How about another great flash? How about maybe one of the very best college quarterbacks ever? Vince Young with the Ooh. 2006 NFL Rookie of the Year, Offensive Rookie of the Year, Vince Young flash rep, two-time Pro Bowler in the NFL in college, played maybe the greatest championship game ever. It's the College Football National Championship tonight. Georgia and TCU, the greatest national championship maybe in any sport I've seen. Well, not the World Cup, because Argentina won. World Cup, number one for me. But outside of the World Cup, maybe the second best championship game ever, Stephen. Uh, the 05 Rose Bowl. Vince Young, 467 total yards uh, against USC. Uh, Single-handedly won that game against a great defense. A uh, beautiful flash rep. Uh, that is Gregory Crow taking home the Vince Young. So this loaded dice is, it's called loaded dice for a reason, man. Tyree Kill, Vince Young flashes. That is rock solid. All right, babe, what's that path? Uh, so Dak barely better than Minshew says the spats. And this is why I say Jack Prescott's I'd not relax. overrated. I'd relax. I would relax a little bit, but a lot of folks are, are low on Dak. Uh, so Vinny's saying TCU Moneyline. Uh, and Terry, that is the Warren Moon Authentic Helmet next to Steven. So Mark asking Kevin about the Discord. Uh, so there you go. Uh, two top 20, number one, says Vinny on TCU. I mean, Vinny, look, I've got a lot of money on TCU plus 12 and a half. So I hope they win. That would definitely mean I win my bets. He's talking about the picks for the Bears. Oh, for, for the Bears? Yeah, or? for our number one overall pick. Oh, okay. Because he was talking. Oh, about local Detroit. radio in yeah. Detroit saying Lions have a path to trade for number one from Bears. I'm okay. sure the Bears are listening. Uh, they got to listen. I yeah, know we talked about it. this yesterday. I know I want Bryce Young and I want to trade Fields. They can still get a lot for Fields. But either way, Bears got to 
entertain all offers. You gotta listen to everything. Gotta listen to everything. Most primal position they've ever had. <laughs> uh, Jeffrey asking what's left in headliners in the quad break. Uh, we have a Terry McLaurin and a Kirk Cousins left in those mini helmets for the quad. Uh, we have an authentic helmet coming up in Loaded Dice. Tyree Kill Flash Rep, Vince Young Flash Rep. Uh, we are absolutely rolling in Loaded Dice. This is even, uh, I mean, it's going to be better because it's the authentic. It's 8 and 11 chance at a headliner. This would be a ridiculous triple box break here, Steven. What do we have here? You are welcome, Jeffrey. Almost an 80% chance at a headliner. Let's see what we got here, Steven. Here we go. It's a headliner. One of the best defensive players of all time. Uh, he's got maybe the best hair ever. We got ourselves Troy Polamalu, Ooh. Eclipse Authentic for the Steelers. That is Austin Mayfield taking home the Polamalu Authentic. Love this yellow ink on the black helmet. A uh, very clean helmet right there. Congrats, Austin. A uh, rock solid with the Polamalu. That's a great crate right there. Troy Polamalu, Tyree Kill, Vince Young, all specialty helmets, two flashes, two reps, one authentic on the Eclipse. Mr. Polamalu, that six says Darcy. Uh, nice says Vinny. Uh, first time seeing him says Vinny. Uh, hell yeah, win for Baker's cousin. That's right, Austin. Uh, damn, that sharp says Nick. Very nice says Denny. Uh, we do work on trying to get new names in the room as much as we can. Again, Vinny has only been with us a couple months. We have had Pulamalu a lot in the break room, but it's been definitely a few months since we last had him. So don't see Troy very often. Uh, that's right, and D Denny hasn't been in the room very often either. I want to say about last fall we He's had been this here guy. often, just not for too long. It's it's been a while. It's been a while. But Pulamalu, two times Super Bowl champion former Defensive Player of the Year, eight-time Pro Bowler, Pro Football Hall of Famer, College Football Hall of Famer, uh, very nice Austin Mayfield, Baker's cousin, uh, taking home the Steeler Authentic.